Hello students. Last class we have started with book 2. With the first chapter addition and subtraction of numbers up to 100. And we have done the topic addition using the number line. Today we will start with the new topic that is addition of one digit numbers. Okay. So let's start the new topic. So students have a look at your books. Can you see a table drawn in your book consisting of numbers? So now before explaining this table, I want you to know about the rows and columns. See now I have drawn the columns and the rows for you. So the vertical lines which move from top to bottom those are called columns and your written materials are inside this column from top to bottom and then rows the lines drawn from left to the right and your written material is from left to right that is called rows all right so now come back to the table now see here the numbers which move from left to right is called the rows and in this table there are rows and columns drawn. So can you see the plus sign here? Okay. So this we have the plus sign and then the numbers from 0 to 10. This is called the first row. So in the first row we have numbers from 0 to 10. Then again in the first column we have the plus sign here and then the number from 0 to 10. Okay. So then this table we have to add the numbers in the rows and the numbers in the columns. We have to add the numbers and then we will get the addition grid here. So the numbers filled in this grid by adding is called the addition grid. So, so this table after adding is called an addition grid. Now how the numbers are added let me show you. What you will do is you will take the numbers in the column one by one and you will add the numbers in the rows. Now see let me take the first number here 0 and with this 0 we will add all the numbers in the first row. So let us do it 0 plus 0 is equal to 0, 0 plus 1 is equal to 1, 0 plus 2 is equal to 2, 0 plus 3 is equal to 3, 0 plus 4 is equal to 4, 0 plus 5 is equal to 5, 0 plus 6 is equal to 6, 0 plus 7 is equal to 7, 0 plus 8 is equal to 8, 0 plus 9 is equal to 9 and 0 plus 10 is equal to 10. Same way we will take the next number that is 1. Again we will add 1 with all the numbers in the rows. So 1 plus 0 is equal to 1, 1 plus 1 is equal to 2, 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 and so on till 10 we will be adding. Then again the next number then you will take 2 then add all the numbers in the first row till 10. Then the second number, I mean the next number 3, then again you will add 4, then 5, then 6, then 7, then 8, then 9, then 10. You will take this number one by one and then add all the numbers in the first row and then your this table will be filled up to the number 20. So this way this addition grid is made. Alright. Now you will have to add numbers using this grid. Now one example is here 4 plus 7. 
you have to add 4 plus 7 using the grid. Now let us find out 4 in the first column. So here you have 4 in the first column. Then second what you have to do is find 7 in the first row. Here we have 7 in the first row. Now 4 plus 7 you will get 11. Okay. So you will do this way. Alright. Now look at question number 2 in your book page number 4. Look at the grid above and add as shown. Number A is already done. 9 plus 8 is equal to 17. 9 plus 8 is equal to 17. So you will find out 9. It is here. And then what is the next number? It is 8. So 8 in the first row is here. So find out the number. So here is 9 and here is 8. So your number is 17. Okay. So, your answer will be 17. So, see here, number A, 9 plus 8 is equal to 17. Then number B, 6 plus 7. You have to find out 6. 6 in the first column and 7 in the first row. So, 6 and 7. 6 here and then 7 you will move like this and the answer is 13. Then you will write here 13. Then number C. 7 plus 6. So let us find 7 here and then 6. It is here. So again your answer is 13. Then you will add and write 13. Okay. So this way you will do D, E and F. Alright. I hope you can do it. So now let us move to the next page. Now you have a table drawn like this in your book page number 5. See, can you see it? Add and fill the colored boxes in the grid as shown. Now see, these are the colored boxes. You have to add the numbers and fill the colored boxes. Is it okay? So as I have shown how you have to add, so let us do same way. Now see here, colored box. So 0, you have to fill this box. 0 plus 0, you have to fill here. 0. Then this box. 0 plus 1, that is 1. Let us do this second row first. Okay, we will fill this second row first. So now, next number is 0 plus 4. Your answer will be? So it is 4. Then let us move to the next row. This box you have to fill. That means 1 and 1. So 1 plus 1 is 2. Then next this. 1, 6. 1 plus 6 is 7. Then again, next row, 2 and 2. So, 2 plus 2 is 4. Then what is the next? Now, this number is already done in your book. That means 3 plus 3, that is 6. Now, here another box, that is 3 and 5. 3 plus 5 is 8. Then again next one is 3 and 7. So 3 plus 7 is 
3 plus 7 is 10. Okay. So, the rest I am leaving it for you. You have to complete it and learn it. Alright. Okay, students. Take care. Bye-bye.